welcome back with more explosion as the maniac Tim Sylvia continues his quest for his first win here in CWA as he takes on our newcomer Dante. Now Sylvia has just had a really tough time here in CWA so far. His first match with the Federal Four Way to crown our first champion, he was eliminated first by Samoa Joe. And next time he was in the ring in a title match against Extreme, we thought Sylvia then might pull out an upset victory, but in the end, Extreme beats him. As of late, Sylvia has just been trying so hard to get a, a win here in CBA, and he always comes up just short of the three count. So we'll see how he does tonight against our newcomer, Dante, who made his debut at the pre-show in Cyberslam, taking on Jacques. And here comes Dante. This man had an amazing match opening up our CWA uh, uh, Cyber Slam event in the pre-show against Jacques where he just totally decimated the Canadian love machine. And tonight he has a, a tough challenge ahead of him in the Maniac. Like I said, the Maniac may be winless, but he is a very, very, very tough opponent and everybody that's beat him has barely beat him, barely etched out that win. So we'll see how Dante does tonight against the Maine's own Maniac. As the wrestlers get ready to square off in the in the ring, uh, you see the crowd just anticipating this matchup. Everybody's ready to square off and get this match underway. And there goes the bell. Immediately, just a back and forth. And, but Sylvia gets the upper hand with that big club right to the back of Dante, and Dante quick to get out of it. Let's see how Sylvia's a hard submission style of wrestling. Well, now apparently now he's just doing some striking as well as taking Dante down. Well, fair. As I, as I was saying, see how Sylvia's senses will fare up against Dante with his speed and his quickness here in this matchup. Well, that takes care of Dante's quickness. And it looks like Sylvia is going for an abdominal stretch. Already starting with the submissions, trying to wear uh, Dante down. But Dante manages to break the hold. And Sylvia is just demanding that Dante get up. Into a back suplex. So far, Sylvia is just dominating the match, is punishing. Dante. Now a series of shots brought to Dante's chest and lower abdomen. And Sylvia's going to the top rope, but manages to barely miss that diving elbow. Now Dante's got the upper hand. And already he's setting him up and he just choke slams him right over the top rope. Now that's just vicious. I'm gonna trade some blows outside. Looked like Sylvia was going to try to throw him into the announce table, but just barely missed it. Quick reversal. And Dante just rams him right into the uh, steel ring post. And just jams Sylvia's arm right into the side of it. Make gets back in the ring to break the 10 count. And again, working on the arms of Tim Sylvia is not is actually a pretty good thing for Dante to be taking out Sylvia's arms, because that will really limit what Sylvia can do in the match as far as his submission and his striking goes. 
are actually smart gameplay by Dante to take out Sylvia's arms. He's dragging Sylvia into the into the middle of the rings where he can't use the ropes to his advantage. Sylvia manages to counter out into a belly to belly suplex. And he jams Dante's knee right into the ring. Now going for that Jujigatami armbar. But unfortunately Dante's just way too close to the ropes. But Sylvia's not letting go. This is uncharacteristic of the maniac to actually break the rules. He must really be frustrated by this winless streak of his. Dante rolls out to get away to collect his breath, get focused, and pays for it with a running shoulder tackle. And an over the head belly to belly suplex. Dante counters and drags him back into the center of the ring. And again, going to work on the arms. And now. He's got a leg lock onto Dante. He's just opening up the submission 101 rule book. Using submission after submission to get him. And now he's going for the ankle lock, but Dante manages to break out of it. Dante blocks that kick. They both miss it into a bulldog. That took a lot of steam out of Dante. Now Sylvia uh, once again has the upper hand in this matchup. He's going for an STF. And Dante manages to get his hands right into the ring ropes. And again, Sylvia refuses to let go of the submission. And finally on the count of three, he lets it go. And Sylvia is finally starting to show some fatigue in this match against Dante. Tosses him into the corner. Wonder what he's gonna do to him now. He jams him, sternum first, right into that top rope. He's driving all the wind out of Dante's lungs. And another over the head belly to belly suplex. He's continuing to punish this kid. And Dante manages to break out. Dante's starting to make a comeback. And he's gonna. He's going to crotch Sylvia across the top rope. Guess Dante remembers what this move feels like from the Cyberslam pre-show and decided to give Sylvia a taste of it himself. Misses the, the flying shoulder and he jams his elbow right into Sylvia's knee. Sylvia counters. into a shoulder breaker. Now again going to work on the legs of Dante damaging trying to hurt each and every single body part hoping one of his submissions will pay off from that. And he misses the off the top rope move and Dante once again gets the upper hand in this match. You, you can clearly see though that Dante is hurt by some of those moves. And now a springboard moonsault I don't know if that did more damage to Sylvia or to Dante's midsection after all the beating he's been taken by Sylvia. And a flip kick right into Tim Sylvia's face. Now, Dante said, but no, Sylvia reverses. He ducks the punch into a springboard DDT. Dante is still so far managing to keep control of this match up against the Maniac. And now he's going for his retribution leg lock, his, his, his leg submission, trying to get Sylvia to submit. He's reaching back on those legs and lower back, trying to, to get Tim Sylvia to give up the tap out. But Sylvia refuses to, let, to stop this match, he refuses to give in. And a series of shoulders right into the, into the arm of Dante. And a 
third over the head uh, suplex. We're going to take a quick commercial break, but we'll be back with more action between Tim Sylvia and Dante. Stay tuned. 